Kenneth Blanchard, one of my favorite leadership authors, once said, feedback is breakfast for champions, emphasizing its importance. So why is receiving feedback so important? And why is it regarded as one of the top emotionally intelligent capabilities? Getting feedback is like being given a map that shows up your hidden blind spots, things that other people notice about you, but you may miss. Now, when it comes to feedback, we all love positive feedback. We feel good about it. But the real gem is the critical feedback. Imagine a colleague in your team who speaks over everyone and comes across as really intimidating. Without the ability to receive this critical feedback, the team's mood is affected, their creativity is affected, and so is their psychological safety. And this already undermined the entire performance of the team. What I'd also like to point out is that feedback is not reserved for those one or two meetings we have with HR every year. We are continuously receiving feedback, whether it's with a colleague over a cup of coffee, or whether it's with a customer over the counter or on the phone. So I feel it's really important to be open to this continuous feedback. So let's explore five reasons why critical feedback is important for you. The first is continuous improvement. It helps identify specific areas for improvement, maybe skill gaps or our behaviors that are not serving you or the team. The second is accelerating learning curves. It exposes these gaps way sooner than if we were to wait until we were ready to see them. Being open-minded to receiving critical feedback speeds up this process, leading to a faster personal and professional development. The third is improved self-awareness. It helps you see the things you didn't notice about yourself. Once you know, you can focus on changing those habits that no longer serve you or your team, or closing those skill gaps that will help you do the job better. Number four is improved interpersonal relationships. Being open to critical feedback demonstrates humility and a collaborative mindset. It shows you're willing to learn. This makes people feel comfortable around you and you build good relationships with others. And the fifth is innovative problem solving. Critical feedback also helps you find new ways to do things. It creates a culture where everyone can share ideas and build on them. In a nutshell, receiving critical feedback isn't just about fixing mistakes. It's about learning and growing from them. It's your secret weapon to success at work. It helps you learn, get along with others, and be part of a team that is always coming up with great ideas.